Today, we're diving into a topic that's been the center of curiosity for so many people around the world, what is college life in America really like? We've all seen it in Hollywood movies, the huge campus parties, cheerleaders, fraternities, road trips, and all the exciting scenes that make college look like one big adventure. But is that how it really is? Is American college life actually like what we see in the movies? In today's video, we're going to break down the myths, reveal the reality, and explore the different aspects of life as a student in the United States. So if you've ever wondered what it's really like to study and live on an American campus, stay tuned. Let's kick things off by talking about campus life in the American college environment. In the U.S., campuses are often the heart of a student's life. Colleges are usually like many cities, with dorms, cafeterias, libraries, gyms, and even student-run businesses. Some are even larger than small towns. Movies often show these campuses as places where everyone knows each other, but in reality, campuses can be so big that you might not know most of the students. American campuses are full of diversity, with students from different states and even different countries, bringing a mix of cultures, languages, and experiences. Next, let's talk about the dorm experience. In movies, dorm rooms are sometimes shown as small, cluttered spaces where two or more students share a room. This part is often true. Most freshmen, or first-year students, live in shared dorm rooms, and they learn to live alongside people with different lifestyles, habits, and schedules. It's a big adjustment for many, especially for those who've never shared a space before. But while movies tend to focus on dorm pranks and parties, a lot of time in the dorms is actually spent studying, doing laundry, and just hanging out with friends or roommates. It's an important part of American college culture because it helps students learn independence, responsibility, and even conflict resolution. Now, let's move on to one of the most stereotyped parts of American college life, Greek life, fraternities, and sororities. Movies and TV shows often portray Greek life as a major part of college, filled with wild parties and exclusive clubs. In reality, not all students join fraternities and sororities, and each school has its own culture around Greek life. Some campuses have a very active Greek life community, while others barely have any. And while there are certainly social events, fraternities and sororities are also involved in community service, academic support, and leadership development. For many students, it's a way to form lifelong friendships and gain a sense of belonging. But it's not the only way to get involved, there are tons of clubs, sports teams, and organizations where students can find their community. Another classic element of American college movies is the big college parties. It's no secret that there are parties at colleges, and yes, some of them can get pretty wild. But it's not all parties, all the time. A lot of students are very focused on their studies, and some don't go to parties at all. Partying tends to be more common on weekends or around big sports events, but the idea that every night is a huge party is just an exaggeration. In reality, many students spend a lot of their evenings in the library, working on assignments, preparing for exams, or participating in club meetings and events. Speaking of studying, let's talk about the academic workload in American colleges. Hollywood often skips over the academic side of college, but for most students, academics are a huge part of the experience. In the U.S., students are expected to be responsible for their learning and often have to balance multiple assignments, midterms, and projects. College is challenging, and it requires a lot of time management. Many students spend long hours in the library, especially during finals week. And while movies might show students cramming for exams at the last minute, a lot of students work hard throughout the semester to keep up with their workload. It's a mix of lectures, discussions, labs, group projects, and sometimes even internships. One unique aspect of American college life is the emphasis on sports and school spirit. In movies, we often see big football games, cheerleaders, and enthusiastic crowds. And this part isn't entirely fictional. College sports, especially football and basketball, are huge in the U.S., and game days can feel like major events on campus. Students gather to support their teams, wear school colors, and participate in traditions and cheers. 
For many, these games are a highlight of college life and create a strong sense of school pride. But not every student is into sports, and many spend game days just like any other day. Let's also touch on professors and classes. In movies, professors are sometimes shown as intimidating or eccentric characters who either make or break the student's experience. In real life, professors come in all types. Some are very supportive and build close relationships with their students, while others are more formal. Classes in American colleges can vary widely, from large lecture halls with hundreds of students to small, intimate seminars. Professors often encourage students to participate, ask questions, and think critically, and many courses involve discussions, presentations, and teamwork. One major aspect of college life that often doesn't make it into movies is the cost of education and student jobs. American college is expensive, and many students work part-time jobs to help pay for their tuition, housing, and other expenses. Jobs range from working in the dining hall to tutoring other students, or even working off campus. Student debt is also a significant concern for many graduates, and managing finances is a big part of the college experience for a lot of students. Movies rarely show this reality, but it's a major part of life for many. Extracurricular activities are another essential part of college life. Students in America have the chance to join clubs, societies, and organizations that reflect their interests, from cultural clubs and volunteer groups to academic societies and political organizations. For many, these activities are a key part of their college experience and help them develop skills, make friends, and sometimes even guide their future careers. Another element of American college life that Hollywood doesn't always capture is the diversity on campuses. American colleges are incredibly diverse, with students from all different backgrounds, ethnicities, religions, and countries. This diversity brings a richness to the campus experience that helps students broaden their perspectives and prepare for life in a globalized world. Many students learn so much just from interacting with people who have different experiences, beliefs, and perspectives from their own. Finally, let's talk about independence and personal growth. College is a time when many young adults are living away from home for the first time, and it's a period of major personal growth. Students learn to manage their time, set their own goals, and make decisions on their own. For many, college is as much about developing life skills and discovering who they are as it is about earning a degree. While movies focus a lot on the fun parts of college life, in reality, it's also a time of hard work, self-discovery, and sometimes, a bit of soul-searching. So, to answer the question, is American college life really like the movies? Well, yes and no. Some aspects, like the sense of community, the school spirit, and the excitement of newfound independence, are true to life. But movies often exaggerate the parties, the drama, and the carefree lifestyle. College in America is a unique experience, with its ups and downs, its challenges, and its memorable moments. It's a blend of academics, social life, and personal growth, and for each student, the experience can be very different. Thank you for watching! If you enjoyed this deep dive into American college life, make sure to like, subscribe, and leave a comment below. Let me know if there are any other aspects of American culture you'd like to learn about, or if you're a student, tell me about your own college experiences. See you next time!